guys, it's Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. Grateful you're here. Grateful I had a great day today. Grateful for everything in my life. I am so blessed. Anyhow, I've got a palette here. I've got a 24 by 24 canvas that has seen three tries, three attempts today. And uh, I'm not going with those seaside colors. Apparently, it just doesn't work. This is caramel drizzle, and it's mixed with a little bit of quinacridone nickel azo gold from Golden. This is lemon sorbet, and it's mixed with a little bit of uh, Liquitex um, cadmium yellow hue medium. This is DecoArt um, acrylics in Poetic Plum, and it's mixed with Pitwheel. This is Twinkle, and it's mixed with nothing. It's a Naked Piggy. This is Groovy, and it is mixed with nothing. <laughs> this is Blue Eyes, and it is mixed with a little bit of Decoart Americana in Turquoise Blue. So I'm going to attempt to do Whenever I go bigger, it, it's harder. So I'm going to try to do a flat cloud pearl pour. I'm not gonna use a lot of color. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. <laughs> the last one I did turned out so beautiful and it is, um, but it's a smaller one. So I'm putting a little bit of white in the bottom. That's the cloud mix. And we're gonna put some of the groovy then some of caramel drizzle followed by some white followed by lemon sorbet followed by some white followed by blue eyes. I love this color. It really sells up nice. And I'm going to follow that with the pinwheel. And I forgot to use Galaxy in the last one. So I've got it this time. I should have put it in several places, but we can still. What I usually do is once I hit the first splat, there's still some um, residue left in the cup and I use that as well in places where I think I need it. So I'm going to put that aside, flip my canvas. This is my cloud mix that I've thickened up. I'm going to give it a very sh short shake, a short shake. And here we go. Hopefully that's enough. Ooh, there's some pretty things going on in that cup already. Now, I'm going to tilt this over. This is a large canvas, so I might need to put down a little bit more of the cloud mix. I've always wanted to do the TLPs in the Cloud Pearl Pour, and I followed Erica Hughes' uh, mixing video on, I see something right here. I think I got it, no I didn't. There we go, now it's gone. Um, yeah, I followed her recipe on how to mix the, the TLPs, and it worked. At least it worked on the last one. We'll see how it works on this one. Now I don't want too much paint on here because once I, I don't want to have to tilt it a lot. So I've got to make sure I've got enough paint off. Um, yeah, we want to tilt as little as possible because when, you, the, when the um, paint hit the, the canvas, the velocity of the paint hitting the canvas creates some really cool webbing. I need some more down here. I 
don't like to waste. And back, oh, need that nice and smooth. And then back this way. Uh oh, there goes my push pin. Dang it. I'm going to do something else with this. There we go. So I'm going to stretch the bejeebas out of this paint. It's not moving. Oh, I see some moving now. I think I'm going to need more. Just a little. You know what? Don't like to waste. There's lots on here. Lots and lots. Maybe I'll cover my sides with that. Put a little bit more down to stretch out. My hands are filthy. They're not filthy, they're just full of paint. God, I hope this works. The last one was beautiful. All right. Just move this around with my fingers a little bit. And then we'll move it down. Okay, here we go. There it goes. There it goes. Hope you guys can see this. There's not really much to see right now. I'm just tilting this white stuff off. White stuff? Oh, white stuff, you say? This is magic. This is magic. <laughs> Gotta thank Sarah Taylor, Melly D. Erica Hughes for giving me the recipe to the TLPs. Making sure I've got enough paint off. I'm gonna wipe my wipe my sides down, and then off we go. I wipe my hands off. Wow, what a mess! Give it a quick torch. I'm not gonna torch it after I do this flat. I'm only going to use one cup. Hopefully that's enough because I have, frankly, when I use two cups, it seems to be too much. Maybe I should have another cup ready just in case. Then what will I do with it? I can always cover it. Oh, shoot. All right, I'm going to do it just in case. guys and I hope it works out I did use a second cup wow all right let me move this real quick Wow, you guys should see the sparkle on here. Holy Toledo. I'm liking it. Let me flip this around so I've got better control. And then 
more we stretch, the more cells we get, or more curls we get. Now, these are getting a little wonky, so I'm gonna move them over this way. And then back this way. And then I'm gonna call it. That's why I don't want a whole lot of paint on here, because I don't want to have to do anything to this. Just let it do its thing. So, I'm gonna put you on time lapse. This time, last time I put you on time lapse, I put you on the fast, the fast one. So I'm gonna put you on the slower one. And uh, I'm gonna move it around this way again. And there we go. Wow, here come the, here come the pearls. And I'm just getting all the, the bottom drips off so that we can keep the composition. All right, guys, I'm putting you on time lapse. I might fiddle with it, I'm not sure.
I'm getting this all in. I have no idea. Um, yeah. I like this. I love the softness of it and the brightness, the, the boldness of some of these colors, like the, the groovy. It's nice to mix those up. And uh, there's that um, twinkle. Pinwheel. It's all pigments. Very cool. I didn't want to enhance it too much. As a matter of fact, I think I went too far right here. But um, I didn't have any of the yellow or the, um, not the yellow, the lemon sorbet or the um, caramel drizzle. So I wanted to incorporate that in there. It turned out okay. And I like up here, look at those pearls and that lacing. I like that it's all chaotic up here. chaotic world. So I think I'm going to call this chaotic garden or jardin something. Look at that. Oh. I hope it dries well. <laughs> Famous last words. Hope it dries well. And uh to look at. I'm pretty happy. I even like those little splats, you know. Once in a while you see a, a dot. Look at those colors mixing. The blending is just unbelievable. Who would have sunk it? Too. And then I did a last flat here. Well, that wasn't last. It was actually right in the beginning. I just took them right out of the, um, the pots and just threw it on there. The colors. I didn't mix them into a... Look at that. Ooh, la, la. <laughs> Craziness. I hope it dries well. All right, guys, um, I'm gonna let you go for now. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please be safe and create. And all my work is available for sale.